12th Nico Santos, who is braving the humidity with more on how it really affects us. Hey, Nico. Yeah, well, you know, the first thing that a lot of people think about when it's humid outside that their hair is going to get kind of frizzy. Thankfully, I have enough hairspray on to not worry about that. This is really hard to tell on camera, but the water bottle really sweating because of the temperature difference and the humidity out here. Uh, unfortunately, it's not sweating as much as I am, but we got we have a serious story here. We're talking about the potentially harmful effects of humidity on your body and maybe your wallet. Blowing dust, lightning, and rain. The yearly rite of passage, that is monsoon, pumps in the humidity. Of course, we sweat more. But Dr. And Natasha Bouillon of One Medical in Phoenix says it's more difficult for our bodies to cool off. The sweat doesn't evaporate, so it just sits on our skin. So the body keeps sweating, risking dehydration. Lethargic, really tired, and it's atypical for them. They might be more dehydrated than they realize. Humidity also affects respiratory issues, such as asthma and allergies. It even aggravates arthritis. I know when and a storm is coming because I feel it in my knees, I feel it in my hips, and there's actually some truth to that. Dr. Bouillon says the air pressure changes that bring humidity directly impact your body, making some pains worse. Here's some perspective. As of 2.30 p.m., humidity in Phoenix was at 26%. What about Atlanta at 69%, New York 71%, Honolulu 63%? You get the idea, it could be way worse, but you still may look for some relief. The air conditioner is gonna have to work a lot harder to cool the air. That means this weather pattern could actually cost you. And if you set the air back a few degrees before leaving the house today. Not a great idea. Mike Donnelly of Donnelly Plumbing and Air Conditioning says temperature changes, even a few degrees in humidity air puts extra strain on your AC. Another tip, the AC fan should not be permanently on. You want to turn it to the auto position so it only comes on when the unit comes on. That's because the unit holds condensation it pulls from the air. And the air blowing across it will pump more moisture into the house and make it more humid. Okay, well, it's not all bad. We got to think of some of the good things here. Now, we were talking about having frizzy hair earlier, but the humidity is actually really good for your hair. It's great for your skin. You're less likely to have a bloody nose, and uh, as the, by the looks of it, at least with the clouds and all the moisture, great sunset pictures. In Phoenix, Nico Santos, 12 News. Okay, if you say so to all of that, Nico.